Hi everybody, my name is Rob Lucier. Uh, I just wanted to make this really quick video on um, the announcement that uh, Her Excellency, the uh, Governor General, Julia Pelliot, has uh, resigned as being the head of state and the Governor General uh, of post-nation state Canada. And that's an amazing um, um, revelation. She's a hater, she's a homophobe, and it's great to see her go. For those of you who don't know who the Governor General is, um, she is the head of state for Canada. Um, because we have a constitutional monarchy, um, the Queen is our actual head of state, and when she's not around, because she doesn't come across the pond very often, uh, the Governor General takes her place, which means she signs all legislation. Um, and as a matter of fact, just last April, with the stroke of her pen, she outlawed uh, assault weapons in Canada, because that's the uh, the kind of power she actually has, as well as she's Commander-in-Chief of the Canadian Armed Forces. Um, as such, she is charged with the welfare and uh, the well-being of the members of the Canadian Armed Forces as, uh, as being the Commander-in-Chief. Julie Pagliat, of course, did not fulfill any of those obligations. I myself uh, reached out to her uh, as someone who was uh, mentally abused while in the armed forces in the army itself and subject to uh, years of homophobia and, and, and abuse. Um, I reached out to her as well and uh, she blocked me. Uh, she just would not hear it. Um, I had tried to appeal to her and uh, she blocked me on Twitter and then on Facebook and as well as uh, had me banned, I think, from Twitter because um, shortly thereafter I was banned. Uh, you can take a look at my old account at CFAO2020, uh, which was uh, the account name is CFAO2020. CFAO so Julie Payette never really fulfilled her role, I don't think, as Commander in Chief of the Armed Forces. Um, I don't think she thinks of the people in the military have a high regard at all. She's a hateful individual and I'm really glad to see that, uh, that she's resigned. I would have preferred that she would have been fired and dragged out of her office by the RCMP in chains. Um, but unfortunately she resigned, which means she probably will be able to keep all her perks, which means her $150,000 uh, of staff and travel and uh, and her her pension for life, which is 100%, uh, and her title as Her Excellency. I imagine because she resigned, she gets to keep all that instead of being fired the way she should have been and dragged out. I'm sure Her Majesty the Queen is very, very, um, what's the word I should say? Very, very um, impressed with the uh, choice that the Pride Minister, uh, Justin Trudeau, uh, made in appointing Julia Payette as the Governor General of Canada and her representative, being how hateful and how homophobic that Julia Payette really so, is. So, who do we get as a new Governor General? Considering that Justin Trudeau is the one who has to make the decision, should be interesting.